Chapter 1. The Enduring Bonds of Love In a cozy little town called Willowville, there lived two warm-hearted grandparents named Grandma Millie and Grandpa Joe. They were the kindest souls you could ever meet. Their love for each other seemed to fill every corner of their charming cottage. Every day, Grandma Millie and Grandpa Joe would wake up with big smiles on their faces. They loved each other so much that their love spilled out like the sunshine over a field of colorful flowers. And what they loved more than anything in the world was spending time together. As the sun peeked through the curtains one beautiful morning, Grandma Millie prepared a delicious breakfast filled with her famous pancakes and freshly squeezed orange juice. Grandpa Joe, with a twinkle in his eyes, kissed Grandma Millie on the cheek and said, Thank you, my love. Your pancakes make my heart dance with joy. After enjoying a hearty breakfast, Grandma Millie and Grandpa Joe decided to take a walk in their lovely garden. The flowers stretched towards the sky, reaching for their loving touch. Grandma Millie's gentle fingers brushed against the velvety petals, while Grandpa Joe hummed a sweet tune. They strolled hand in hand, sharing stories of their adventures when they were young. Grandma Millie giggled as she remembered the time she caught her toe in a fishing net while Grandpa Joe swiftly untangled her. Grandpa Joe smiled, recalling the time he pretended to be a superhero and rescued Grandma Millie from a tree. Their love seemed to grow stronger with every step they took. They stopped under their favorite oak tree and sat on a wooden bench, enjoying the peacefulness around them. Grandma Millie rested her head on Grandpa Joe's shoulder, feeling his warm embrace. Your hugs make everything better, my love, she whispered. Grandpa Joe planted a gentle kiss on Grandma Millie's forehead and replied, And your kisses make the world brighter, my dear. Together, they watched the birds flutter and sing, creating a melodious symphony that filled their souls with happiness. They knew that love was like the bird song, spreading joy to everyone it touched. Back at their cozy cottage, Grandma Millie and Grandpa Joe spent the afternoon baking cookies. Flour covered their aprons, and laughter filled the air as they playfully tossed spoonfuls of dough at each other. The sweet aroma of freshly baked cookies filled their home, making it even cozier. As the golden sun began to set, Grandma Millie and Grandpa Joe sat by the fireplace, wrapped in a soft blanket. They leaned in close, whispering sweet nothings to each other, their hearts overflowing with love. Grandma Millie, let's promise that our love will endure forever, Grandpa Joe said, placing a hand on his heart. Grandma Millie smiled, her eyes sparkling, and replied, Yes, Grandpa Joe, our love is like a never-ending story, with each chapter filled with hugs and kisses. Together, we create a love that will last for eternity. And as the fire crackled and the stars appeared in the dark sky, Grandma Millie and Grandpa Joe fell asleep, holding hands. Their love was a treasure that would forever warm their hearts and inspire everyone around them. Because in the town of Willowville, Love was a language spoken by Grandma Millie and Grandpa Joe, effortlessly connecting hearts and creating bonds that could never be broken. Question, how do grandparents show their love? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 2, Stories That Inspire Grandparents are often the best storytellers. They have so many stories to share, and they always seem to know just the right ones to tell. These stories are not just entertaining, they are inspiring too. They teach us important lessons and give us a glimpse into their life experiences. One day, Jamie was visiting their grandparents. Grandma and Grandpa loved telling stories to Jamie and sharing their wisdom. After a delicious meal, they all gathered in the living room. Grandma started the star-telling session. Let me tell you about the time I traveled to a faraway land, Grandma began, her eyes sparkling with excitement. I was young then, just like you, Jamie. I hopped on a plane and went to a place I had only seen in pictures. It was amazing to see the towering mountains and crystal-clear lakes. 
That trip taught me to be brave and explore new places. Jamie listened intently, eager to learn from Grandma's adventures. They realized that life experiences can help you grow and become a better person. Grandpa joined in with his own story. I remember when I was a little boy like you, Grandpa started, a twinkle in his eye. I used to climb trees every chance I got. One day, I climbed the tallest tree in the whole neighborhood. It was scary, but I didn't give up. It taught me the value of perseverance and to never be afraid of reaching for the stars. Jamie was filled with a newfound courage. They wanted to try new things and be brave just like Grandma and Grandpa. There was something special about hearing stories from their grandparents. It made them feel stronger and ready to face the world. As the stories continued, Jamie learned about the importance of kindness, honesty, and family. Grandma shared a story about helping a neighbor in need, while Grandpa recalled a time when he learned the hard way that honesty is always the best policy. Each story held a valuable lesson. Remember, Jamie, Grandma said with a warm smile, Life is full of ups and downs, but the lessons you learn along the way will guide you through any challenges you may face. Always be true to yourself and treat others with kindness. Grandpa nodded in agreement, and never forget that family is the greatest treasure we have. We stick together no matter what and support each other through thick and thin. Jamie cherished these stories and the invaluable lessons they held. They knew that the tales shared by their grandparents would forever inspire them to live a fulfilling life. With every story, they understood the power of storytelling and the importance of passing down wisdom through the generations. As the evening came to an end, Jamie hugged Grandma and Grandpa tightly. Thank you for sharing your stories with me. I feel so inspired. Grandma and Grandpa exchanged knowing glances. They were proud to pass on their knowledge and life experiences to their beloved grandchild. With a smile, Grandpa said, Remember, we're always here for you, Jamie. Just like our stories, our love will guide you through anything. And with that, Jamie went to bed, filled with gratitude and a newfound zest for life. The stories of their grandparents would forever dwell in their heart, continuing to inspire and guide them on their own journey. Question, why are grandparents' stories inspiring? Check the video description for the